Hi everyone, welcome to Solaris Gaming and this is Tap Tyson's 2 acronym guide. Now I've had quite a few people message asking about what do these certain letters and abbreviations and names mean. So I'll go through the list. I'll give credit to Lemon Llama for doing a fantastic job of doing all these acronyms, all, all this research. I'll put a link to his Reddit post to this guide in the description below. Please click on that and follow that for the latest update to these acronyms. So to start with, starting from alphabetical order, so most common ones you get is AA which is error assault that's just gives skill that gives clanship damage and clanship splash then AAW is astral awakening and then you get AC which is arcana cloak and that reduces your war cry mana cost active skill is just as it says and uh, someone asked for AD it could be one of two things either referring to artifact damage and that's all damage bones given by artifacts or it could be AD percentage which is acid drench and that's an affliction card you get ADR which is adrenaline rush AE which is ambrosia elixir and and if it's AF, it could be avian feather, which is an artifact that gives inactive damage, but also could be ancestral force, which is a support card, and that increases burst chance and damage. Then you have affliction, which is obvious. And AG stands for Angelic Guardian. Alt refers to alternative account, which is typically the weak account as opposed to your main account. Ambus, obvious. And AO stands for Apollo Orb, which is an artifact which multiplies pet gold bonuses. Arts stands for artifacts, but sometimes people call these artists. I'll call them art myself. AOM stands for Axe or Vuretti, and that gives critical chance. AR is Angelic Radiance. Armor stands for Armor and Titan Laws. AS is either MES Stars or Ram Spear. That's an artifact that reduces Titan health. And Ash stands for Anchoring Shot. Now, some people will sometimes call it AS for short. Assassinate is an obvious one. So ATC fans stands for anti titan cannon aviator is an obvious one's aviator boost aw stands for ancient warrior and that's the mythic set that gives you companion attack rate b stands for billion in monetary value barrage is the clanship barrage card that is used as uh, a burst card that deals additional damage per attack burst bc stands for bronze compass bf barbaric fury a skill that increases your tap damage and tap pressure when tapping and if someone asks you bf say no unless it's me then you can be my bff and um, bod stands for blade of democracy which skill artifact gives you sword bonuses and body stands for body type titan nords so h is Boot of Hermes and um, Bop is your Book of Prophecy, BOP, and that artifact gives you all gold. BOR is Bringer of Ragnarok. BOS is the most important artifact, that's your Books of Shadows. The artifact gives you more prestige for relic bonuses and your build, that just refers to your skill tree build. First card, obvious ones, and CC stands for Clan Crate, and CD is your cooldown, and that's the time it takes for an active skill or quick time event to complete until it's ready for next use again. Chain stands for Psychic Chain, which is a burst card that deals burst damage to arms and legs, sometimes called PC. CI is Crushing Instinct. CO is coordinated defense, COC or cock for sure, the chest of contentment, the artifact gives you chest in gold and the only artifact, artifact everyone would recommend that you pump, so make sure you pump a lot of cock. Series coins of Izabu, the artifact that multi gives you multi spawn gold, companion damage is obvious, Cote is charms of ancients and Cot C is crown of constellation, CP stands for craft and power and there's passive skill that boosts your power of your equipment set bonuses cq is clan quest that's what the previously what clan raids used to be called before it was removed in 3.0 and you get cr which is clan raid which is what they're called now crh is corrupted rune heart crit stands for critical chance cs is clan and ship and cst is cleaving strike which gives you critical damage but reduces your critical chance Dailies is your daily rewards you get for logging in each day. DC is Divine Chalice. Decay is your Decay card, which is an affliction card. DH is your Drunken Hammer, which is an artifact that gives you tap damage. Discovery pools. Now, artifacts are unlocked in a certain order, so you need to unlock all artifacts from an earlier discovery pool before you can unlock artifacts in a later pool. So that's what I mean by discovery pools. DM is direct message, used when you talk to someone directly on Discord. Doom is obvious. DP stands for Dark Predator, which is a mythic set. DR is Divine Retribution, which is an artifact that gives you all damage. DS is Deadly Strike, the active skill that allows you a chance to chance at additional damage when you hit a Titan. DSH is Dimensional Shift. 
DS is Durendal Sword and Duelist is an obvious one. ED is Eternal Darkness. Enchantment and Enchantment Pools are obvious. EOE is Elixir of Eden and that artifact gives you Shadow Cane damage. EOF is Egg of Fortune. EOK is Essence of Kitsune. EOP is Earrings of Patana. ES is Everglare and Stack. The artifact gives you all damage per car led level. F P stands for free to play, typically saying that players who haven't spent money will lose or benefit from a change. F2P players who have not spent any money on the game. Fat Fairy, Mama Fairy, the fairy that drops perks, also known as a Fat Fairy. FB, Fury's Bow. FC is Fairy Charm. And FG is Fagan's Grip. FOE is Fruit of Eden. FOTK or FOTK is Foliage of the Keeper. The artifact gives you slash boost and range hero damage. FOTS or FOTS is Flute or Solist. Frag is short for Fragmentize, which is a burst card. FACE, Fire Sword, the active skill that gives tap damage. Also can stand for Forbidden Scroll. The artifact gives deadly strike duration bonuses and can also stand for Fatal Samurai, the mythic equipment set that increases your pet level. Fundamental damage, just as it sounds. Fuse is Fusion Bomb, which is an affliction card. FW is short for Fortune Weapon. And GA is short for Glacier Axe. GFM is Great Fey Medallion, an artifact that gives Fairy Gold. GH is Game Hive, the developers of this game. Gladiators, just as it sounds. And Gok is Glove of Kuma. GM is Grandmaster, the leader of the clan. GS is Ghost Ship. A skill that gives inactive clanship damage and clanship deadly strike. HB is Hero's Blade and HM is Heroic Might. HO is Hunter's Ointment and HOH is Helms of Hermes. HOM is Hands of Medas, the active skill that gives gold. Also Helmet of Madness, the artifact that gives helmet bonuses. Horn, Gullar Horn, and HOS is Heart of Storms. Hot L is, or HOTL is Hourglass of Impatience. HP is a health, is the hit point or health points of the amount of health that a Titan has left. HS is Heavenly Strike. HSH is Heroic Strike, the artifact that gives boss gold. HSK is Helm Skull. HSW is Heavenly Sword. HW is Hero Weapons. And IAP is In App Purchases. IE's influential IF is Inspiring Force, which is a support card. IG is Invader's Galahorn. Inferno is Blazing Inferno, which is Affliction card. IP is Imitating Presence. IPE is in Infinity Pendulum. IS is Invader's Shield. K is a Thousand in Currency. KB is Chrysos Bowl. And Night Boost is just as it sounds. KV is Knight's Valor. KV is Knight's Valor. And LB is Lightning Burst, a skill that allows your pet to splash through bosses with quick time event. It could also mean Limit Break, a skill that gives you more mana regeneration and a larger mana pool. LF is Lucky Foot of Al Mirage, and LKM is Lost King Mask, and LL is Lemelima, the friendly legend who made this guy. LP's Laborer's Pendant, LS is Lightning Strike, LTR is Lifetime Relics, the number of relics the account has gathered during the entire lifetime play. You can view this on your stats page in the Hero tabs. M stands for Millions, it's a currency, and Marksman is just how it sounds. MB is Moonlight Bracelet, MC is Master Commander, MIR is Make It Rain, the perk that gives you gold bonuses in your current stage or maximum stage. Manny is Manny Mana, MBS is Mystical Beans of Senzu, sometimes it's just called Beans. MI is Mystical Impact, Milestones is a new update recently which is achievement after reaching a certain max stage that gives rewards. Sometimes resources will also need to be collected before the reward is unlocked. MP is Mana Potion, MS is Max Stage which is the highest stage you've ever been on on your account. It can also mean Mystic Staff, the artifact that gives you Mana Regeneration or could mean Mechanized Sword, the mythic set that reduces passive skill costs. MSW is Mongeli Sword. MT is Master Theft. MU is Midas Ultimate. Mystic is just how it sounds. NS is Neko Sculpture. OB is Oath's Burden.
OKS is Old King Stamp, OP is O'Brien's Pendant, and ORC is Orion's Charm. OS is Oak Staff, the artifact that reduces Fire Sword Mana Course. It can also, if sometimes ask you what OS you're using, they're asking if you have an Android or Apple phone. So if you aren't using an iPhone, just say Android. PTW, pay to win. Typically, some players who spend money will win or benefit more from a change. PTW players are players who spent money on the game. P is Pet Evolution, sometimes called Pet Evo. Pet AA is Pet Auto Attack. P H O M, Heart of Das, the night skill that gives you gold when you tap on it. The P stands for Pet, so it differentiates the acronym for H O M, which is Hands of Das. Plague, Thriving Plague, is Affliction card. P M R is Pet Master Race. POF, Parchment of Foresight, Porter, which Porter is a stage skip titan that skips 50 stages when killed. POS is Power or Swiping. PR is Prismatic Rift, PS is Power Surge, PT is Phantom Timepiece, Purify is Purifying Blast, which is a burst card, PV is Phantom Vengeance, PZ is Flash Chip, the skill that allows your pet to kill bosses using a quick time event, sometimes called Pet Zip or FZ or P Zip for short, QRS, Quill or Scrolls. Radio, it's short for Radioactive, which is a fiction card. Rancid is Rancid Gas, it is a support card. Regen means mana regeneration, so how much mana you gain over the course of a minute. Respec, when you reallocate your skill tree points by removing all the current skill points from your trees. Rock, Ring of Callisto. NR stands for Ruthless Necromancer, which is a mythic set. Rogue Boost is just how it sounds. RS is Ringstone. RT is Royal Toxin. And RW is Razor Wind. SA is Shadow, Shadow Assassin, SAD is Sword Attack Damage, a damage multiplier for any attack that uses a sword, SB is Skull Bash, SC is Shadow Clone, SCMR is Shadow Clone Master Race. It's just statements show that Shadow Clone is the best build. Goal is short for Hero Scrolls, SEP is Hero Weapon Sets, SF is Soul File, which is a support card, SG is Swamp Gauntlet, Shadow is Grim Shadow, which is an affliction card. Shard is crafting shards which are used to craft equipment. SI is summon inferno. Siphon is mana siphon, a skill that gives you mana when you tap or having shadow clone activated, sometimes called MS. Skeleton, SL is searing light. SM is silent mark. Snap is snap the titan, the titan that halves the number of titans per stage for the next 50 stages. SOJ is sigils of judgment. SOR is staff of radiance. And sorcerer boost is just how it sounds. SOS is the Sword of Storms, sometimes called TSOS. SOTR, Sword of the Rules. SOTV is Stone of Valruns. SOW is Spools of War. And SP is Skill Point. It's a resource that allows you to get skills from the skill tree. So it could be Strife Piece, the artifact that gives you all hero and tap damage. Splash is just how it sounds. SS is the most gay sword. Delve just how it sounds. Support be two things. Game Hive support team. Click on the gear in the game, then click on the support icon to contact them or go to gamehive.com forward slash support. It could also mean support raid cards that multiply your damage when activated. SV is servant vigil. T is trillion currency. TC is Tyson chest. Teapot, a band for cheating where the word teapot is played in the top left corner of your screen. If you get this and you cheated, your account is useless. If you didn't cheat, you can submit a support ticket by clicking on the gear in the game, then click on the support icon or go to gamehive.com forward slash support. TH, treasure hunter, a mythic set. TI is tactical insight. Ticket, which is a raid ticket, is a resource gathered by completing daily logins and use to start clan raids. TM is Titan Masks. TCP is the Cobalt Plate. TMS is the Master Sword. TOF is, is the Treasure of Ferg. TOS is Terms of Service. TP is Titanium Platin. TR is Retaliator. TS is Titan Spear, the artifact that reduces the hands of Midas mana course. Also, Titanium Spear, the artifact that gives Heavenly Strike Hand of Midas and Shadow Clone multipliers. TT1 is the original Tap Titans. You can still download it, but it's no longer being updated. TT2 is Tap Titans 2, the game you're playing. TV is Twilight's Visual. TWD is the White Dwarf. UC is Undisputed Champion, the person who wins a tournament without trying. UG is Unbound Gauntlet. 
undisputed win a tournament without trying anything else it's sometimes called undispute binds it's grabs from vine which is a support card and vip very important person a system that rewards you for spending a hundred dollars pounds or currency on the game giving you 75 percent off skill tree respect and salvages vm victory march which is a support card warlord boost which just as, as it sounds WC stands for War Cry. Whip is Whip of Lightning, which is a burst card. W O D is Ward of Darkness. And XP is Raid Experience, the amount of experience you have that contributes to your raid level. Also, clan experience. The amount of experience your clan has earned from the raids and contributes to your leaderboard placement and advanced start. ZC is Zaxanoth coin. If you've got any questions, leave a comment below. If there's any other guys you'd like to see, leave a comment. I will be releasing tap title videos every Tuesday and other guides every Thursday. Day. You can also see me stream on YouTube and Twitch every Sunday for 9 pm GMT time. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you have a great day and see you all soon. Take care.